Today's episode has brought us to the quiet village of Arusi in South Goa, where we are excited to meet local artisan Simoni Rego. As we are watching the carving being done, one can notice how this requires a lot of precision. She first draws the pattern on the pot and then uses the tools to carve out the desired pattern. Once the cartwork is complete, the pot is then left to dry. Now that we have seen our cartwork and detailing is done, let's go back to the beginning and find out how the clay is molded from scratch. In order to make the pot, the clay dough is molded and then placed onto the wheel. Using the help of water and fingers, it is then molded into the desired shape. The wheel never stops turning as the pot takes its shape. One can see how this process requires hard work, determination and most importantly a sturdy hand. Once the pot is shaped, it is left to dry after which intricate designs are carved into it. Once the pot is dried for several days, it is then placed into the kin and baked. So this is my wood fire kin, very proud of it. Built it here. This is the same house. The replica of a kin from where from my previous studio. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Gomantak Times YouTube channel, your gateway to Goa.